Legendary music teacher at a Fallbrook High School is being honored by his former students. In this morning's Emily Zone, Jeff shares his big day in Bonzel. A cake like this would be music to anyone's ears. Happy 102nd birthday, Bud. It's not often you see fingers more worn than piano keys. Where does the time go? That's a good, that is a good question. I don't know. Bud Roberts started playing piano at the Peking Walk at 76 years old. He's now turning 102. Why did I play so long? Yeah. I didn't get fired. <laughs> After joining the Army and fighting in World War II, Bud became a music teacher. Hello, darling. Rosa was his choir student. Oh, hi, Rosa. Come <laughs> In 1974. Everybody knows him in Baltimore. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's an icon. <laughs> Mr. Roberts was the band director at Fallbrook High from 1956 to 1979. Happy birthday to you. The restaurant couldn't hold all of his adoring fans. Parking lot could. Fallbrook found a way to honor this man, past, present, and future. In honor of yourself and your efforts and paving the way for us, we are announcing today the Bud Roberts Music Scholarship. Yeah. Jerry Sayer was Fallbrook High's drum major in 1970. Bud, I haven't seen this much commotion since Bono was in San Diego. He's just a treasure. What is his legacy? Well, I like to think we are his legacy. I mean, I, I played music professionally for 15 years after, after school. As a teenager, Bud drove from dance hall to dance hall, playing the piano, and just never stopped. Your dad renewed his driver's license at what age? 99. 99. 99. <laughs> Everybody loves him. Everybody loves him. Some people say the glass is half empty. Some say it's half full. He's the kind that says, doesn't matter. Drink up, we'll, we can get a refill. <laughs> Playing by ear, his fingers just find their way. When you hear a certain chord, it does get you, it does hit you here. Finally, at the age of 102, it was time for the piano man to take a bow. In the Zevely Zone. Thank you, Mr. Roberts! Woo! Jeff Zevely, CBS 8. Yeah!